What's going on everybody? It's me again, Golden Blue Dude. If you haven't already, go ahead and hit that like and subscribe button. I do college football videos every single day. I really don't like doing car videos, but I felt like I had to because the idea popped in my head and I was in the car. That's how it happens sometimes. So I'm hearing a lot of talk that the Big 12 is going to invite BYU, maybe Boise State, UCF, Cincinnati, Memphis, and maybe some other teams from the AAC. That the Big 12 is sticking together. They're going to stay a Power 5. West Virginia is not going to the ACC, but I'm wrong, my sources are wrong, and this proves it. Still disagree with that. Here's the thing. Number one, if the Big 12 is sending an invite to these teams that are in the AAC, would that be doing the same exact thing that they're accusing the SEC of doing? Torches interference? Wouldn't that get them in a lawsuit? And here's another thing. This thing is more political and business driven more than people realize. This is a battle between Fox and ESPN. ESPN has no zero media rights to the Big 12. Fox does have media rights to the Big 12. ESPN has exclusive media right deals with the SEC, the ACC, and the AAC. That's another reason why I think the Big 12 won't be able to get these teams. ESPN won't allow it. Fox is the enemy. There is no way that they would allow those teams to go over there. They would throw whatever money they had to to make it happen because the big plan for ESPN is to shut down the Big 12 have it dissolve and shut down a competitor in Fox. They have more money because they're in with Disney and ABC. Way more money than Fox ever could provide. So maybe the Big 12 can go out and get Boise State, BYU. I'm not sure when the contract is up for Boise State in the Mountain West. I'd have to look into that. But as far as the AAC, I just don't see that happening. And the deal between West Virginia and the ACC is still on. And to be honest with you, it's more up to West Virginia than it is the ACC. So could West Virginia do something stupid and turn down a deal with the ACC to stay in the Big 12 and try to keep it going? Yeah, I guess they could, but that would be one of the dumbest decisions ever. I just don't see it happening, guys. So I definitely don't see any AAC teams jumping from the AAC to the Big 12. I don't see it happening, guys. In fact, I think ESPN's plan is to try to take from the Big 12 even more West Virginia to the ACC, more teams to the AAC, and try to get the AAC promoted to a Power 5 conference. That way they would have media rights to three of the Power 5 conferences. That's my take on this situation. Y'all let me know what you think. That's all I got for you for this show. Like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you on my next show.